Right, uh, I've already played this one on the uh, the modern Newmark uh, ultra modern record deck that I've got. But as I say, to hear a 78 uh, and to do it justice, you've really got to hear it on a proper gramophone. So you're, you're hearing it this time on this uh, black 102, one of the two uh, HMV 102s that I've got uh, wind up gramophones, purely acoustic. And it's an excerpt from the uh, Scarlet Pimpernel. And uh, though we may listen to this and think it's not that remarkable, uh, the audience of the day would have known these two actors and would have known this play. It was a very popular and long-running play, so t to have been able to go home and play this record and hear your stars playing in your own living room would have been quite uh, outstanding in those days. But those of us like myself in our 50s, we, we can remember uh, when, you know, to be able to even record sound from the television was uh, remarkable. My dad uh, set me up uh, with a wire out of our higher television, and I used to record onto reel-to-reel -reel, you know, -reel tape programmes like uh, Top Cat and cartoons and things from British television of the uh, of the, the late 60s onwards and into the 70s and uh, the first video recorder I got was 1982 and blimey you know to be able to hear and see you know you know stuff on, on your own television screen you've recorded yourself that was absolutely amazing so just imagine the audience of the day in about in the early 1900s being able to go home and listen to their two favorite stars um, names were Fred Terry and Julia Nielsen. They were a married couple and a very famous uh, acting duo. Uh, as I say, performing this excerpt from a play that had been very popular at the time. Not the best, uh, I think, uh, excerpt. They could have done Do you see him here? Do you see him there? That elusive pimpernel. But uh, they chose this excerpt anyway. Let's have a listen. Thank you. 